was a sort of revelation to most of them that there was this thing called a photograph library that actually you could go and consult and you could find out all sorts of things there which were not in the books or if they were in the books they were there in the photo archive in a different order or a different format which all helped with the learning process. Well, that was for the Richard Wilson catalogue, um, catalogue resume online, because that's what I came here uh, as a research fellow especially to, to do. Really, I had a sort of tabula rasa in a way. You know, here's Wilson, tell us about him, in the most comprehensive way you can, using and identifying and tracing every possible known and unknown work of art by this really quite, in some ways, quite a sort of undervalued um, artist. So one of Richard Wilson's most famous landscapes is a picture called Ego Fui in Arcadia. I, too, was in Arcadia. And it's a picture which shows two classically robed shepherds sort of looking in puzzlement and um, surprise at an ancient tombstone um, with the caption on it, I too was in Arcadia. So it's a sort of memento mori, you know, it's sort of reminding them that they too will die and that the person in the tomb had once been alive, so sort of moral, philosophical reflection. Through the photo archive, I did, in the end, discover the current owner. There were a number of examples like that, but why that is my favourite, or one of my favourites, is because it's such an important picture and it would have been such a gap not to actually to, to have gone to see it. Serendipity is very important. It's one of the major advantages of a photo archive. You might be working through, um, through a file and you would come across something that you had no idea existed before. So that's a new discovery. Or you might come across something, I mean this is a bit more tangential, but from time to time you come across something which has been misfiled. Um, either subject-wise or even artist-wise sometimes, that could lead you off on a tangent, but an interesting tangent.